Do I remember it? I think I do with that joint ass. I ain't even gonna say that joint. That joint ass. Yo, I'm trying. I'm trying to rap. This was like it wasn't no poem. This was like an actual rap. My poems used to be hitting. Like I say that joint with my rap. this first rap. That joint was like I can't even tell you though. I don't even wanna say nothing wrong with it. I don't even wanna say nothing wrong with you about that. But I started, um, when I realized I could uh, put rhymes together, I feel like it was around, around the time I was writing poetry. Um, that's the first time I started playing with words and like taking it serious. My homie Dev, he was the one who told me to like, I should start write, writing on beats. So um, I feel like I realized that once somebody like told me like, yo, you got a dope sound, you don't sound like nobody else. And I was like, all right, I'm gonna run with that. I ain't really forced myself to try to be like nobody else, even though I like admire other rappers. But I feel like like that my, my poetry stretch, my poetry stretch. I feel like that's what solidified my like I could do this for real, for real, and take it serious. I start from the top. How could I fail with a flow fresh out of hell? With too many thinking they real, cause they been in and out of jail. Your man is scrub, shorty creeping, he couldn't tell. By the look you want him to throw in the towel or ring the bell. Um, it's pretty much like, I'm in a city where, you know, we known for like, gangster rap. And like, you feel what I'm saying? And your street cred, and that's pretty much the Philly like, you know what I mean, narrative. Like, outside looking in. but. You ain't got to be real or official to be like, you feel what I'm saying, a Philly rapper or a Philly artist. And I feel like I'm going to make that known. I'm gonna, That's what I represent. And that's what that that's what that bar pretty much was like representing too. Um, we're too many thinking they real because they've been in and out of jail. Your man is scrub, shorty creeping. He couldn't tell. Like, um, that's like a TLC reference. You know what I mean? And pretty much it's like, yeah. Shorty, shorty dealing with somebody probably locked up. She making those those jail trips, you feel what I'm saying? Those jail calls. And she going right back home and doing doing what she got to do. So she probably creeping, doing something that she ain't supposed to. Telling him the same, the same run around. Because he, you know what I mean? He probably been in there for whatever time. Whatever time. And, um, and that's, that's pretty much what that is. The game open, even if it wasn't, I was making rum, I'm getting old. Not too long ago, my homie jumped the broom, told me she don't got it right now, then she gonna want it soon. You know niggas' favorite line is what they about to do. Um, the game open, I just feel like even if it wasn't, I was making rum, I just feel like that was, that was like a competitive edge in me. That was the competitive side in me pretty much saying, I'm gonna bully my way in the game if they not gonna allow me to, as far as like my sound. You know what I mean? My style of rap probably not on the forefront of hip hop right now, but we gonna make its way. So that was my competitive like edge on that. So that's some some drive that it that that I got from it as far as the line. And um the game open, even if it wasn't, I was making rum. I'm getting old. Not too long ago, my homie jumped the broom. He told me she don't got it right now. She gonna want it soon. You know niggas favorite line is what they about to do. It's pretty much we we all be in relationships. And, you know, making that jump to as far as making your lady your wife is sometimes like it get pushed to the back. But it's, it's pretty much a grown man like job for real, for real, and a grown man decision. But we always say what we about to do in all aspects of life. So that's what I tied it into. But mainly talking about relationships and making that step with my lady and my relationship. You feel what I'm saying? That's a personal note. Just like. Like what's what 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 I'm waiting on pretty much. Like you feel what I'm saying? Six years and for for somebody else it probably it's probably more, but you feel what I'm saying? Make that step, put that ring on it, man. You know what I mean? You've been with your lady ten plus. Stop playing. You feel what I'm saying? Let's get it back. Shake the city up. Oh one Kobe and Shaq. <laughs> Nothing took me born to do it, but I barely flex. I knew this watching one on one. I wanted Kyla Pratt show him something different. I promise that's when they get attached. Time to turn my hustle up. We on the last lap. Ignore me if they want. Guarantee I get the last laugh. Um, that's a long stint right there that I just said. 
But um, shake the city up, O1 Kobe and Shaq. You know when we lost the finals, the city took a heartbreak. I cried. You feel what I'm saying? I, don't, I forgot how old I was. I think I was like eight. Yeah, I was like eight or nine. I was like eight. I took I took an L. I cried on that one. But shake the city up, O1 Kobe and Shaq. Nothing to me, born to do it, but I barely flex, you know, just regular talking my talking my talk. I was born to, you feel what I'm saying? So when I say born to do it, but I barely flex, it's tying into like flex used to be Kyla Pratt Pop on one on one. If you ain't know, that was a little three three little joint combo that kind of tied in. But you know what I mean? I feel like everybody wanted Kyla Pratt when she was in her when she was in her prom back in the day for real, for real. Show them something different, I promise. That's when they get attached. And you know, that's just the style, you feel what I'm saying? It's a different type of town right now, and I feel like my style, we can we can break open. Um, time to turn my hustle up, we on the last lap. Rest in peace, Nip, you feel what I'm saying? Rest in peace, neighborhood. Um, but turn my hustle up, we on the last lap. You already know how that is, he just dropped last lap. Um, so that's how that, how that tied together. Ignore me if they want, guarantee I get the last laugh. Um, that's, that's self-explanatory, you feel what I'm saying? That's just for Philly. That's not just for Philly. I'm talking about the industry, tri-state, whatever you want to call it, man, the whole game, you feel what I'm saying? We're going to make our noise, and we're going to do it silently, but it's going to eventually blow up, you feel what I'm saying? Time is in between that. Um, rest in peace, Nip. Um, but that was just, you know what I mean, turn my hustle up, time to turn, turn the pressure up. We on the last lap. You feel what I'm saying? This the last go round. You feel what I'm saying for the team and just drive spark a fire. He just dropped victory lap. You feel what I'm saying? And that was well deserved. The Grammy nomination. Rest in peace to the legend. You like it? I love it. What we discussing? We matching up. I'm Megatron. I catch it in double coverage. And when I get behind it, just relax and let me navigate till she get it popping like a Walmart on a Saturday for the game. Eight ball corner pocket. Shane Batty, eh? Yeah, hot to I feel like we back in the day. Um, that was a long stance I just said too, but what I, what I start with, um, you like it, I love it, what we discussing, you matching, we matching up on Megatron, I catch it in double coverage, I mean, 81, Calvin Johnson, you feel what I'm saying, Detroit Lions, I'm pretty sure, I don't know all my NFL fans out there, but he a monster on the field, wide out, catching everything, one hand, deuce hand, whatever the case may be, but. That's a, just a, another competitive bar that I had in that in that aspect. What we discussing, we matching up, I'm Megatron, I catch it in double coverage. When I get behind it, just relax and let me navigate till she get it popping like a Walmart on a Saturday. Um, just relax and let me navigate. You already know, we in the bed, you know what I mean? Getting right, Walmart jumping on a Saturday, you already know what time it is, you feel what I'm saying? <laughs> Um, till she get it popping like a Walmart on a Saturday for the game. Eight ball corner pocket, Shane Battier. We all play pool. You feel what I'm saying? Just another little metaphor. Um, you know, a little competitive, competitive, uh, competitive bar right there as far as just ending the verse. Shane Battier, you already know, Heat, a little closer. He was a good little, you know what I mean, closer for them, but just reverting to that, like, I'm gonna close the verse out, you feel what I'm saying? And wrap, wrap the joint all up. Um, shout out to All Bars Matter, Headquarters Media, man. You already know what it is. Mitch Lake signing out. <laughs>